Uh, On-chain data shows the Bitcoin exchange reserve has shot up during the past day, um, indicating that more drawdown may be coming for the price. A few days back, a crash shook both Bitcoin and the wider cryptocurrency market as the BTC price plummeted from above $29,000 to below $26,000 instantly. In the days since then, the asset has failed to show any signs of recovery, either as its value has only continued to move sideways. As the chart below, where this side below, uh, Bitcoin is trading around $25,800 suggesting a decline of 11% during the past week. This weekly performance of the number one asset in the sector is worse than some of the other top coins, like uh, Ethereum and um, Cardano. Um, and it's currently unclear whether the asset has hit its bottom or if more decline is on the horizon, but if on-chain data is anything to go by, the latter may be more likely um, as pointed out by an analyst in a crypto quant post, the exchange reserve has risen uh, during the past few hours. Um, the exchange reserve here refers to a measure of the total amount of Bitcoin currently being stored inside the wallets of all centralized exchange platforms. And you know, um, when the value of this metric goes up, the investors are. Uh, depositing a net amount of the asset to these platforms right now um, as one of the main reasons and holders may may transfer their coins to the exchanges uh, is for selling related purposes this trend can cause bearish implications for the cryptocurrency's price and on the other hand decreases in the indicators value imply the holders are taking their BTC off the central entities um, and such a trend may be a sign that the person is part of the work in the city. Uh, the assignment that is asked if, if the uh, medication of the city and the community. Now, here is a chart that shows the uh, trend in the Bitcoin exchange reserve uh, over the past week or so. The graph shows that the Bitcoin exchange reserve has registered a sharp uptick uh, in the last uh, few hours, implying that investors have been depositing big to these platforms. The chart shows that the indicator also rose during the build-up to the crash, but the sharpness of the growth being observed this time is on another level. Uh, in the lower graph, the quant has attached the data for the individual reserves of Coinbase and Binance, as well as for all spot and derivative platforms. And it's apparent that most of the rise has come from the derivative side of the market, with Binance seeing the largest spike. Uh, investors use spot exchanges for selling. So the fact that most of the deposits have been towards derivative platforms may imply that investors are just looking to open up new positions on the futures market, which can also lead to more volatility still. The direction of it could go either way. Uh, nonetheless, the spot exchange reserve has also observed a rise although much smaller in scale, suggesting that a sell-off might still be possible.